All right, people. Uh, I'm sorry that I missed last week about giving away a free pedal. I had some issue with my car. Uh, it was pretty traumatic, but it's all good now. We're not going to turn this video into anything other than talking about my new product, which is, uh, I'm calling it the MK Classic, okay? But we're going to give away a free pedal because I tell you, I got some hanging around. But we're going to talk about the MK Classic. It's based upon a tone bender, an MK tone bender, MK2. But this is actually the reissue version that I based it off of. I based it off a two transistor design. Now, this pedal is similar to a Dallas Arbor style circuit. It's really quite similar, except it has uh, capacitors between the legs of the transistors and it's also biased differently it reacts differently to your playing it's a little bit louder than the Dallas Arbiter we're gonna hear what it sounds like and uh, I hope you enjoy what it sounds like but uh, let me tell you more about the free pedal that I'm giving away this week now this is an early build that I did of a circuit that's very similar to this I changed the circuit a little bit when I decided I was gonna make a lot of them I changed it to make it a little bit louder and uh, some of them have a little bit more gain than others. And I put more, more robust transistors in uh, all of them, in fact. But the one that I'm giving away is, is the first one that I built. I built it months and months ago. And I forgot about the circuit. And I put it in one of my enclosures that I messed up. Okay, I was practicing my metal stamping. And it got it all dented and stuff, and I, I just never throw anything away. So I put a, a circuit that I hadn't, you know, done in a while inside of it. I did this circuit months ago. It's basically the same circuit that I'm selling, but it's slightly different. But this one I'm going to give away for free, okay? And we're going to talk about what the contest is going to be. Uh, we have a picture of it. Of the one so you see how it's all dented and looks all crummy and I even put a cheesy Halloween decal on it I just can't throw anything away and so this you're getting a build that works it sounds good it's probably a pretty sloppy build but we're gonna say what we're gonna what the contest is okay now the contest is that I'm thinking of a fast food place that I get coffee from and if you can if you can guess what fast food place I go to get coffee from and what I order, then you get a free pedal. The first person that does it, okay? And it's also a place that I used to work at. And uh, I'm not going to give any more hints, but it's, it's like a fast food style place that I like to get coffee from. Oh, wait. I just said what I ordered. Oh, my God. <sighs> I got to start. <laughs> No, it's, uh, I get coffee from this fast food place, but you gotta say what exactly I order. What kind of coffee I get. You know, what size I get. And, uh, cause I used to work at this place. Okay, and if you can, so I used to work at this place. And, and you gotta guess exactly how I have my coffee. And then you can win the free pedal of the week. Okay, it's not that hard. You know, you just got to think of like what a Midwestern guy, where does he go to get his coffee? Okay. And what does he exactly does he order? And it's not that hard. Okay. So, uh, let's hear how this pedal sounds. Okay. Uh, what's different about this circuit is that it reacts differently to, to your, to your touch. It's like you could either get a really thick, it's like the fuzz gets fuzzier the harder you play. And if you if you play light, it's not that fuzzy. But if you play really hard, it gets really saturated and thick. And so I'm going to try to demonstrate that. And I'm just going to run it uh, full volume up, full gain up, and then we're just going to play with our volume knobs on our guitar. And so we're going to go from kind of conservative, somewhat fuzzy types of sounds into full out. And so we're going to hear what that sounds like. And first, I'm going to play a little bit clean so you hear what it sounds like. Okay? But I'm not going to do any more talking. You're just going to listen to it.
So it sounds pretty psychedelic. Uh, I hope that gave you a good idea of how it sounds like. Um, so it's it's basically kind of like a Mark II tone bender, kind of like that. But I'm calling it the MK Classic. That's what it's called. And you, don't forget that you have a chance to win if you can guess where I get coffee at and what exactly I order. And one of the hints is that I used to work there. Okay? It's a fast food place. This is an easy one. It's anybody can guess. And you, uh, we're going to say that you get one guess a day. Okay? So you got a good shot of winning one. Uh, I'm ho I hope that the playing sounded okay. I, I'm not used to playing at these loud levels anymore. I, I uh, you know, but... Uh, I think that you'll be happy with these. If you like my other pedals, then you'll be happy with these. Uh, 
we're calling it the MK Classic, and uh, I I had some pictures of what they look like going up. I think I have about six of them in the enclosures, but I've built tons of these circuits. In fact, you can see them right there. Uh, they're kind of out of focus, but uh, I know this is so professional of me, uh, but... Uh, I've built quite a few of these, and so uh, I, I'll probably be loading up more once these sell. So, so everybody have a good week, and uh, make your guess to see if you can win a free guitar pedal from me. And uh, I think we're probably going to be selling these pr pretty much at the same price as we've been selling. Uh, probably around $40, maybe 50 Probably around 40. I think we'll just keep these at 40 because I feel I actually do feel like making more of them. So let's just sell these uh, if we can. But uh, they're different than the Arbiter. A little bit louder. Uh, a little bit more low end is what I think that they sound like. Uh, and I think a little they react different to how you pluck the strings. So uh, I will see you next week. Bye. Oh. You gotta buy them at Dad Tech on uh, on Reverb. That's where my store is. It's it's on Reverb. Dad Tech. Buy Dad Tech. Okay. I forget to tell people where to buy them, but just buy buy them on Reverb. Dad Tech. You'll find all my. I'll give you a link to my store in the bottom. <laughs> all right. See ya. Bye bye.